Welcome to our show, Sacred Tools for Divine Living with Violet Rain, where Violet provides you with practical ways to bring in more joy and financial abundance into your life. Violet creates a loving and sacred space where she shares simple ways for each of us to empower and enrich our lives. We are so happy you have joined us today. Let's get started with your host, the magical creator of Discover Your Spiritual Gifts, Violet. Sacred Tools for Divine Living. Thank you for joining me for this episode of Finding Your Way to Awakening. So what is awakening? Awakening is when we find ourselves in a new space, having a new perspective, a new view on life and the world. So what pushes us into this space? Well, sometimes it can be an accident that we have lived through that makes us go, wow, life is short and I need to look at this differently. Sometimes it can be a major illness that has taken us down and we have survived it and lived through it. Sometimes it can be an experience that was very traumatic that opens our eyes to new things. Um, sometimes it can be as simple as a, um, COVID energy that moves in that you're like, wow, that opens our eyes to have more gratitude, more um, respect, to see the world from a different perspective. Sometimes it just happens that you wake up one day and you're like, wow, everything looks different. How I see the world is different. How I feel the energies around me is different. I'm more sensitive. I feel like I want to isolate myself in the house because when I go out, it's just really hard to move through the energies of all the people around me. And I don't understand what's happening to me or my gifts are coming online. And why am I hearing things? And, or why am I seeing things that nobody else sees? Or why do I know things? Or why am I feeling this way? These are all element of awakening. It's about stepping in to your divinity, aligning with your divine purpose, finding your way back to the path that you were meant to be on in this lifetime. Awakening can be easy or it can be difficult. Sometimes it brings in lots of confusion and frustration. Um, it's hard to understand. Um, we go out and all of a sudden the job that we used to love and we did really well at doesn't feel right anymore. The relationships in our lives that we've had for years that we've loved, all of a sudden the conversations aren't as sweet or as um, exciting as they used to be. We don't have the same interest. The conversation can be difficult. Awakening is when we're starting to step in and things are changing. And along this path, you know, the foods that we eat, the things that we drink, the shows that we watch, the music that we listen to, the relationships we want to hang out with, our interests, all of that can shift and change as well. You know, I have people that come to me all the time that was like, wow, I can't eat these certain foods anymore, or I don't want this anymore, or I used to watch these shows all the time, and I just can't watch them anymore. Those are experiences that are happening that are assisting you in your awakening or shifting your perspective. They're shifting you in knowing who you are and what is different. What I can tell you is sometimes it can be very difficult to go through these types of experiences alone. It's okay to reach out to a community of like-minded people or to find a coach or a mentor or a counselor that can help you sort out what's going on, that can help you understand what's happening in these shifts. It is a unique a personal experience for everyone. However, many of us that have been through this and that have helped people through this have a little bit of an understanding 
of how to support people on this journey doesn't always come with all the answers because it is about the journey and it is about the experience. However, knowing that you're not alone, that you're the only one having this experience and knowing that others have experienced this as well can be very healing and nurturing and supportive as you go along this path. Be kind to yourself. Be aware of what's going on. An awakening is a positive thing. It means you're shifting into your own spirituality. You're connecting to who you truly are. You're finding your way along your path of purpose. I hope you enjoyed this episode and I hope to see you in one of our other episodes and that you check that out. Thanks again for watching. Thank you for joining us. To find out more about Violet and how she can help you discover your spiritual gifts, head over to discoveryourspiritualgifts.com. Check out Violet's services and classes. You can also send a personal message to Violet through email, violet at discoveryourspiritualgifts.com. Until next time, remember, we are meant to have abundant and joyful lives. We hope to see you really soon at Discover Your Spiritual Gifts. Discover Connection. Awaken sacredness Become empowered Come experience a difference at Discover your spiritual gift